Welcome you all to the video lecture on signals and system. Today we are going to find out the transfer function, impulse response and step response for the given differential equation. The equation is given by d square y of t by dt square plus 6 d y of t by dt plus 8 y of t that is equal to 2 x of t. So, to find out the transfer function, we need to apply Laplace transformation and we have to find out h of s that is given by y of s by x of s. For impulse response, we need to take x of s as 1. For step response, we need to take x of s as 1 by s. So, the given equation is d square y of t by dt square plus 6 d y of t by dt plus 8 y of t that is equal to 2 x of t. Let me apply Laplace transformation on both sides. So, I have for d square by dt square it can be written as s square y of t I can write it as y of s plus 6 d by dt is s y of t is y of s plus 8 y of s that is equal to 2 x of s. Take y of s commonly outside we have s square plus 6 s plus 8 that is equal to 2 x of s. So, the transfer function which is also called a system function h of s is given by y of s by x of s that is 2 by s square plus 6s plus 8 and the second thing we need to find out impulse response. So, for finding out your impulse response we know that x of t is equal to del of t. So, x of s is 1. So, wherever I have x of s I have to replace it by 1. So, y of s by x of s is 2 by s square plus 6s plus 8. So, since x of s is 1, I can write y of s equal to 2 by s square plus 6s plus 8 as it is. So, now factorize the 8. So, 4 2s are 8 and 4 plus 2 is 6. So, I can write it as 2 by s plus 4 into s plus 2. So, apply the partial fraction a by s plus 4 plus b by s plus 2. So, when comparing the num numerator in the left hand side is 2. So, a into cross multiply s plus 2 plus b into s plus 4. Substitute s equal to minus 2. Substitute s equal to minus 4. Since s plus 2, I have to substitute s equal to minus 2. s plus 4 means s equal to minus 4. So, 2, anyway this term get cancelled. b into minus 2 plus 4, it is 2. So, b is equal to 1. When I substitute s equal to minus 4, 2 is equal to a into minus 4 plus 2 is minus 2. So, a equal to minus 1. So, y of s is given by substitute in this y of s. So, minus 1 by s plus 4 plus 1 by s plus 2. Now, apply inverse Laplace transformation. So, y of t is equal to minus 1 by s plus 4 means e power minus 4 t u of t plus 1. Okay that is 1 by s plus 2 is e power minus 2 t u of t. So, in general L inverse of 1 by s plus a is e power minus a t u of t. So, using this formula I can write like this. Okay. So, this is the impulse response. Now, I have to find out step response for the given term. For that again I have to take this term y of s by x of s this term I have to take and find out your step response. So, we know y of s by 
x of s is 2 by s square plus 6s plus 8. We need to find out your step response. For the step response, we know that x of t is equal to u of t and x of s is 1 by s. So, y of s is given by 2 by s square plus 6s plus 8 into 1 by s. So, while writing as a factors, how I can write 2 by s plus 4 into s plus 2 into s. Now, apply the partial fractions. So, a by s plus 4 plus b by s plus 2 plus c by s. So, left hand side is 2. So, a into already s plus 4 is there. So, other terms are s plus 2 into s plus b into other terms are s plus 4 into s plus c into other terms are s plus 4 into s plus 2. So, now substitute s equal to minus 2 and s equal to 0 and s equal to minus 4. When I substitute s equal to minus 2, 2 equal to, so this term, this term get cancelled, only b will be there. Minus 2 plus 4 is 2 and I have minus 2. So, 2 to get cancelled, b equal to minus 1 by 2. When I substitute s equal to 0, 2 equal to c into 4 into 2 is 8. So, c is equal to 1 by 4. When I substitute s equal to minus 4, 2 is equal to a into minus 4 plus 2 is minus 2 and again I have minus 4. So, this and this get cancelled minus into minus is plus. So, a equal to 1 by 4. Okay. So, using all these things I can write, I can substitute y of a b c value in y of s and y of s is given by 1 by 4 divided by s plus 4 minus 1 by 2 divided by s plus 2 plus 1 by 4 divided by s. So, now apply inverse Laplace transformation for this. So, y of s becomes y of t that is equal to 1 by 4. 1 by s plus 4 is e power minus 4 t u of t minus 1 by 2. 1 by s plus 2 is e power minus 2 t u of t plus 1 by 4, 1 by s is u of t. So, you should know that Laplace inverse of 1 by s plus a is e power minus a t u of t and Laplace inverse of 1 by s is u of t. So, using that you can apply and find out your inverse Laplace transformation. So, this term is nothing but your step response. Okay. Thank you. Thanks for watching.